One of the growth curves that she's been on this season is her ability to play at two speeds. And that's a good speed there from Alex Bunton and the Caps. Um, it forces everything to be a full second or two slower. Melbourne double teamed quite aggressively there, but Aurel gets the rebound and puts it in under pressure. And now Melbourne just dumps it back into the That's beautiful work from the Caps once again. Smart to Melbourne. Oh, spinning around Capillo, loses it momentarily. Goes in again. Oh, Jade Melbourne. She just keeps surprising us. Yeah, and it's something that you can salvage. So this is what I talk about running your own race. You're able to play everybody and develop them. And that's exhibit A right there. Kaleo with the steal and then Melbourne with the bucket. Munger, let's see if she can respond. Tuliak. Dumps it in to Melbourne. That's a great assist. And Melbourne brings out a little chainsaw there. She's been pretty good shooting from three-point range too. Melbourne up against Cabillo, two young guns, and Melbourne puts it in. It's a shootout that them wanted to play. I think the Caps in the back end of the quarter looked like they'd lost their way a little bit. Goes against the double team, and Melbourne takes the rebound. And using that signature pace to get it across to Pizzy. Melbourne. And steals from one another. Absolutely. Melbourne drives in hard and gets herself another bucket for the game. Perfect. And exactly what I asked for from, uh, from Whittle. You know, the Caps have got some answers to try to find. Oh, There's an answer basket. there. <laughs> some Great answers. Spot. Great basketball from the Lightning. You probably need more urgency on the defensive end if you're the Caps. That's good on the offensive end, though.